Hello everyone, how you doing? I am continuing Half-Life today. The only reason I'm doing it is because it's quiet at the moment. Usually there's a lot going on outside or down in the kitchen, you know. So, I could have done now. So, um, I think we're sort of close to finishing. Uh, not really 100% on how far we'll go. Hmm, it's dark. Just gonna turn up the brightness a little bit, guys. Is that even possible? Brightness? Bright? Oh no. No, it's not. Man, you scary. Ooh, bow. I don't want my shotgun still. Sorry, I had to kill it with my good gun. Whoa, whoa, my health, whoa. Oh. I shouldn't have done that. Come on. Whoa. Oh. Oh my. Oh my. At least I'm not up against now. Ah. I'm going to save that. Oh, thank you. What the hell are you three doing there? Why don't you help him? For me. <laughs> Best line going. Let's walk right into that one, guys. Oh, I thought it left. Come on. Hmm. Wait, I think there's grenades back here. Or not. Oh, there's like a box of grenades uh, or rocket launch uh, rockets instead. Sorry. Mm -hmm. I'm saying, I don't know what I'm gonna do right now. Why do I still see a shadow? Seems legit. Come on, walk the other way. <sighs> Good work, source. Oh, come on. I don't know, I have a clue where I'm going. Oh, 
Oh, what? Whoa! His foot is like... Wait a minute, let me just get my um, sniper rifle out. through them striders again. Oh, you guys. Oh. Keep getting teammates for some reason. I don't even know why. Bloody idiots. As we get rid of all them enemies over and over again. Yes, ma'am. No, I haven't at the moment. Sorry? I can't hear you. Yeah, probably. What just happened? <laughs> Excuse me.
Medkit. So, maybe I'll rerun it from the beginning because I don't remember the route where I was meant to go. <laughs> so, we were this side. La 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 la. Through here. Over here. What's in here? Okay, so la la la. Up here. Around here. Who the hell is shooting me? Through here, across here. It's not obviously that way. It must be up here. And from here. Oh, you bloody mong. Let's go again. So up. Uh -huh. Must be over here. I'm very good at this, am I? Yes. We were looking to join you, Doctor. Save. Dead end? Yeah, okay. Here, boy, dog! Come back here, dog! Damn it, oh. <laughs> Honey. Crashing through the plaza, knocking over walls and looking for Alex. He seems to have it set in his head that she's in the Citadel. I figured Alex wouldn't want him getting any deeper in trouble, but hell, you try stopping him. Hey, dog! Not there! You can't get through that way! Well, I'll be damned. I think he wants you to go through, Gordon. You'd better hurry. And if you see Dr. Breen, 
Tell him I said. Ah, very good. It's obviously not that way. Sweet. Think we might be on the, the next chapter, perhaps? Nope. Oh, yeah, we are. Our benefactors. And there's the Citadel. Should be getting somewhere, guys. Like near the end of the game, I think. So this could be the last part. Oh, I doubt it is, though. The next part will probably be like really short. Yeah, we're near the end of the game now, guys. your heart in one of these things because it looks like like nothing would you would grip to. I can't see any lower though. Oh my god and things are creepy. Starters. Oh, 
Oh my. Oh, it's some ships, God. Security alert. Unregistered weapons detected. Confiscation field engaged. Oh. Nice. Crowbar. No. Sweet. So this is Dr. Freeman. At last. I wish I could say this was a pleasant surprise, but it's neither a surprise nor I didn't want to do that. surely agree very pleasant. <coughs> well, I am nothing if not pragmatic. Oh, you have to say, oh my gosh, dish bag. Oh. They took my good crowbar, I did. Under other circumstances, I like to think we might have been able to work together in an atmosphere of mutual trust and respect. Certainly, judging from your brief tenure at Black Mesa while I was its administrator, you showed every promise of becoming a valuable and productive contributor to the scientific process. And yet, I'm not sure what spurred you to it. But there is really no place in this enterprise for a rogue physicist. Probably not a good idea to go in that.
kills. Oh, right, it's a health and, um, uh, thingy recharger, that's good. Your mentors are partly to blame, of course, my disappointment in Eli Vance and Isaac Kleiner is far greater than my sorrow over your unfortunate choice of career path. In a way, I suppose you could not have done otherwise. Who knows what seeds of iconoclasm they planted when you were young and gullible, but while they certainly share a great part of the responsibility for the recent troubles, it is you alone who have chosen to act with such willful disregard for humanity's future. You're making it so people can't have sex. What the hell is wrong with you? Don't know where to go. No buttons here. No computer. No underground. Mm, I don't know. Switch right now. Shit. Huh. Crap, blinded.
go. Problem. I don't talk in the game, so... humanity's survival and not as we have narrowly defined ourselves but as something greater than we could ever imagine something we can now only begin to glimpse Very unsure about it. Doing. All I know is that. Oh, hello. Hello.
Sorry? Yeah, what's up? Yep. I've almost finished this game, so... Oh, done it. Save. <laughs> Wait, wait, wait. I missed what he said. Um, no idea where I'm... Exploding screen, sweet. Mm. Oh, not that. Health! Yes, get over to health. No, not another one. I'm scared. people in front of me. Hmm. So obviously they know it's me, obviously, so Things are so creepy. So creepy. It's so creepy. Oh, oh. Oh, look faster now. All the rooms just got a lot smaller. One of them. Blimey, this building's tall. Might be second to last chapter. I'll take him from here. Don't struggle, it's no use. Until you're where he wants you, there's nothing you can do. Bitch. <laughs> I'm sorry, Gordon. So, um, yeah, we're quite close to the end now, guys, so... Vast giants, yeah. inhabited by vast meteorological intelligences. Worlds stretched thin across the membranes where the dimensions intersect. Impossible to describe with our limited vocabulary. What I've seen is also beyond words, Breen. Genocide. Indescribable evil. Good God. Well, if it isn't Gordon Freeman at last. What's this? I'll put it over there. You have my gratitude, Doctor. First you lead me straight to the doorstep of my oldest friend. Then you deliver yourself. 
If I'd known you were going to come straight up to my office, I wouldn't have bothered hunting you in the first place. Having both of you in my keeping ensures I can dictate the terms of any bargain I care to make with a Combine. <laughs> Dr. Breen. Huh. Wallace. Yes, Judith, what is it? The bargain we should be making is for Eli's life so he can continue his research. Thanks to you, we have everything we need in that regard. You're more than qualified to finish his research yourself. What neither you nor I can do is convince that rabble in the streets to give up their senseless struggle. Yet Eli refuses to speak the words that would save them all. Save them? For what? Eli, if you won't do the right thing for the good of all people, maybe you'll do it for one of them. Alex. Honey. Dad. Gordon? God damn you, Breen, you let her go. That's all up to you, my old friend. Will you let your stubborn short-sightedness doom the entire species, or will you give your child the chance your mother never had? How dare you even mention her? Alex, my dear, you have your mother's eyes, but your father's stubborn nature. You haven't seen a bit of it yet. Really? Well, let's see how well it serves you on the far side of a combined portal. Go ahead, Bree. <laughs> if that's the worst you can do, send us both through your portal. Oh, it's hardly the worst. But you might find that hard to believe once you get there. It isn't necessary. I agree. It's a total waste. Fortunately, the Resistance has shown it is willing to accept a new leader. And this one has proven to be a fine pawn for those who control him. No! Don't listen to him, Gordon. How about it, Dr. Freeman? Did you realize your contract was open to the highest bidder? Gordon would never... Quoting G-Man right there. I understand if you don't wish to discuss this in front of your friends, I'll send them on their way and then we can talk openly. Don't struggle, honey. Dad. I don't know if you guys noticed, but she actually just pulled something out of her ass. Judith? Thing. What do you think you're doing? We're doing what I could never do alone. We're stopping you. Yes. Guards, get in here. They know you betrayed them. They'll turn on you. Judith! Dr. Mossman, please! I'm sorry, Wallace. You're all out of time. Don't... Hurry! Dad, hang on! You fool! Watch out, he's gonna... No! Help. Oh. oh, what? Come on. There's no time, Alex. He's on his way to the portal. You'll need this. Dr. Mossman, Judith, look after my father. Don't you worry. Dad, I'm not saying goodbye. Never. Let's go. Come on, Gordon. Let's go. Yeah, so just push me out of the way. We haven't known each other very long, but... I know you didn't have to do this. I had to rescue my father, but you... Well... Thanks for coming after me. Hey, listen! That's him! There he is! Damn it, that's what it takes! Just hurry! He's right behind me! Oh, shit! Oof. I can't have it! Not again! The gravity gun. <laughs> he doesn't have a clue, does he? I wonder where he's going. Citadel's dark fusion reactor. It powers their tunneling entanglement device. Never have a chance like this again. We've got to stop Dr. Breen. I can't shut it down. 
Looks like he's turned over control to the other side. You'll have to go into the core and do what you can. Get in the elevator. Let's try and parkour into the elevator. Yeah. Do your worst, Gordon. But be careful. You little motherfucker, bitch. So, this is basically almost the last bit of the game now. It's Dr. Freeman, there he is. Where? Dr. Freeman, you really shouldn't be out there. At the moment of synapse, as I teleport, this chamber will be bathed in deadly particles that have yet to be named by human science. Perhaps when I have the leisure to do the work myself, I'll name one of them after you. That way you won't be completely forgotten. When the singularity collapses, I will be far away from here, in another universe as a matter of fact. You, on the other hand, will be destroyed in every way it is possible to be destroyed, and even in some which are essentially impossible. I don't know what you can possibly hope to achieve, apart from your own annihilation. Don't listen to him, Gordon. Miss. Oh, I didn't mean to look into it. Oh well, life goes on. Ah, oh, no. uh, come on, lag. I still have the worst thing. I don't life. know what you can possibly hope to achieve apart from your own annihilation. Don't listen to him. I'm just shooting him so that he can get out of the way. Oh. I don't know where I'm going. I could have told you that was pointless, Dr. Freeman. Go, Gordon. Are you still with us, Dr. Freeman? Not for much longer, I think. If only you had harnessed your boundless energy for a useful purpose. I hope you said your farewells. I don't actually know what to do.
was that? I'm British. Okay, at least I know what I'm doing now. <laughs> oh no, Green started his ascent. Attention. Hurry, Gordon, before he escapes. So, oh my god, it's totally down the bomb again. Not for much longer, I think. This is the way, isn't it? If only you had harnessed your boundless energy for a useful purpose. Oh my god. Almost fell off the edge. Is it really that time again? It seems as if you only just arrived. You've done a great deal in a small time span. You've done so well, in fact, that I've received some interesting offers for your services. Sorry about that. Ordinarily, I wouldn't contemplate them, but these are extraordinary times. Hmm? <laughs> Rather than offer you the illusion of free choice, I will take the liberty of choosing for you. If and when your time comes round again. I do apologize for what must seem to you an arbitrary imposition, Dr. Freeman. Oh, shut up, door. I trust it will all make sense to you in the course of... Well... I'm really not at liberty to say. In the meantime, this is where I get off. Well, um, guys, that's it. If you've watched the um, whole series, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And yeah, I've definitely enjoyed it. That's the first time I've completed it on my own. Yeah. Bye bye.